I'm going to show you where to find some of the best secret teas of Pinehurst. So obviously everyone knows about the core specific teas. We're at number two here. Number four has their own. Eight, three, the cradle. If you just go to the starter hut, you'll find them there. And in another video, I showed you if you come to the nest just off the 10th green of number two, you can find these teas. We're in the main golf shop here. Now, normally this is full of regular resort teas, but if you come during springtime, it will be full of the spring teas. They come in pink and white, and they've got the Cradle Spring logo on top. Next, you have the Cradle Crossing tea. These aren't typically on show, but if you ask at the bar, they may have some. They go super fast, so these are kind of like gold dust. Next, you have the Country Club teas. They have a different logo on top and a color scheme similar to the number two teas. The Manor tea is a great secret. It's at the front desk of the Manor. It's right there. If you find yourself in North and South or passing by, to swing by the front desk and grab those. And lastly, you've got Dornet Cottage. Dornet Cottage was owned by Donald Ross and is just off number two. Now, I'm not sure it's possible to get these teas, but they are out there. Somebody is definitely gonna die on this trip. What a fucking... Dude, he... he just, he was in a freeway. Did he get out? You got this. <laughs> that was epic. All right, so if I make this, you have to follow me. But no soft bounces that just trickle in, like I've seen other people do. Dunks only. Deal? All right. Whoa, yeah. <laughs> ah. Get in. the bad cards again pick your poison i want this one yours i have to putt like i'm shooting pool i get a mulligan each shot baby let's go oh my i don't think you need a mulligan on that one it's gonna take a lot to beat that one we'll see what happens oh a dinger i still have a long way to go i don't want to play golf anymore not too bad of a shot let's see if i can get this close hmm. may not need a mulligan again Ended up not being as bad as I thought it was. Oh my. I didn't take a molly because I was worried that I wouldn't get it closer than that. Nice. This is so much harder than I thought it was going to be. Not really. After hole two, I'm still up two. Bailey got one more hole to win. Let's go. Yesterday at the golf course, we found something we've never seen before. It was this golf ball saying, if found, return to this P.O. box. This guy really had no trust in himself and knew he was going to hit it out of bounds and lose it. But luckily, we're here to send it back. We gave him his ball, a couple extras, and a note telling him who we are. So hopefully he can reach out and we can make a part two.
If you guys don't want to wait, we can play together. Or finish together. Okay. Did you see where any of our balls went though? I did not. Okay. Sorry. Let us recall. I'll get out of the way after I hit this. Yeah, I'd love to play with you. What do you think? Three, two, one, begin. Go, 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 go. Whoever makes it in the hole first wins. Wait for the slide. DJ, 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 DJ no! Oh. What a legend. I'm kind of busy. Here. Oh, you ain't gonna be so angry about it. Shit. Hello. Don't you hello me. Where in the hell are y'all at? I come to work this morning thinking I was gonna have a nice, pleasant day. Ten minutes in, I realize neither of y'all are here, and somebody tells me y'all done called in. You think I want to be out here by myself? Well, I don't. So where are you? Yeah, we called in today, and we just wanted to go play some golf, man. You should have came with us. What do you mean I should have come with you? Well, I would have. I would have come with you to play that rich man's sport if somebody would have told me that we were calling in today. I mean, it's really not that expensive, honestly. We didn't have to pay a greens fee because... I mean, I don't think we're ever going to be on the green, you know what I mean? But, uh... It, I, I'll FaceTime you and show you what's going on. Let me just turn this thing around. Almost had that one. Almost had that one. Shit, fire, son. He's terrible. Hell, Ray Charles could have hit that one. Uh, why aren't y'all wearing collared shirts out there? I thought y'all was at the country club. What is it? Let me switch you back to... Oh, no. It, they told us to take our collared shirts off. They didn't want people to think we were part of the country club. Yeah. Yeah, we, they also gave us a big discount on the golf cart, too. Since we're cutting all the grass and taking all the limbs out of the fairways. Yeah, they're no, nice people. Nice people. Well, it kind of seems to me like all you're doing is getting angry out there. I mean, he didn't look too peaceful, relaxed, or happy. And isn't that what you're supposed to be playing golf? I don't know, man. I'm having a great time. I understand why people call this game whack fuck now, because here I'll show you why. <laughs> you are straight trash, my guy. Hey, so look, uh, I'll call you after we get done here. We got to go find like 17 golf balls. We have no idea where they are. I will go eat or something after this. I know I'm gonna be fucking hungry. Playing hide and seek all day.
anything negative Cause I just wanna hear it out your mouth, yeah